a thing in my pants. Cat Smiley? Is yeah. it called a handy? I'm not sure what it is. Yeah, either. Okay, whatever you say. She calls it our special tug tug time in the bathroom room. <laughs> She knows the ins and outs of sex, some might say, and uh, she can teach you how to be better at it, I guess. Or just completely horrify you, which I think is about to happen on the stage right now. So uh, give it up for Miss Cat Smiley with Sex Ed. Just got them, very excited. Uh, I got them from a dead guy. Yeah, because you should always have something from a dead guy, you know what I mean? It's like borrowed, blue, something from a dead guy. It's good luck, right? Right. All right, class, I'm here to teach you a few things, a thing or two about a thing or two about sex. You guys know about sex? Did your parents teach you about sex, children? Of course not, because they hate you and love Jesus, so that's why they didn't do that. Uh, I just, this here, this is the puke bucket. If any comedians feel like they can't handle the show anymore, they have to route their feelings into this is where you do that. Matt Bergu is gonna make it anyways. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, so I just thought, you know, we, we just, let's get down and serious about sex, guys. Just thought, you know, I care deeply about each and every one of you, especially do with this foot on the stage. I think that's very cool. So, I care about you, sir. I want to save your sexual soul. And who better than a girl who looks like your high school gym teacher dressed in fucking Tevis? All lesbo down up here. Non-threatening, little white girl hairy legs. I haven't shaved my armpit in like three weeks. I am totally fit to teach you guys about boning, right? That's what I thought. So, uh, you know, everyone says what you should do, you know, is wear a condom. Do you guys wear condoms out there? You guys being safe? No. Fucking, of course, I'm just joking Charlie. Who the fuck's wearing a condom? You guys kidding me? I recently got back from Gnome, and there's a true story. If you go to Gnome, they, like, make you take condoms. They, like, put them in your pockets and stuff when you're not looking. And you know why? Because you're gonna fucking need them. You're gonna need them. And, uh... <laughs> The girls that live in Nome, they carry a toothbrush in their back pocket because once they get to your residence, if they have a toothbrush, it's ca it counts as residency. They can't kick you out when the cops come. <laughs> so when you date a girl and she has a toothbrush in her fucking purse, that's what's up, guys. It's Alaska law. We just know how to get around the shit, you know what I mean? Just want to educate you on sex in Alaska. Another thing, you see comedians up here like Matt Collins. You see Matt Collins all over town. He's like chlamydia. He's all over Anchorage. Watch out. It's out there. Wash your hands and your pussy, man. Just do it. <laughs> it's weird. Uh, so my drink name tag is blank. <laughs> because if you know me, you know Cat Smiley will take anything. <laughs> Alright, guys. <laughs> These dead guy glasses are making me feel fucked up like I'm on mushrooms. I can't, I'm not gonna lie. Would you fuck this? Is this what you're fucking? You know what's going on, Coops? I don't think so. Aw, <laughs> oh, thanks. I hope that's not poison. It is. It is. Totally is. So this is a man's penis. <laughs> and uh, it, it's really good vitamin D and potassium. Cock and 
you, hey, I'll do whatever I want with the banana. This came from my house, as terrifying as that sounds. Uh, so I asked my friends on Facebook to bring me condoms, and this is what I got, because my friends are having so much sex. I got three. But it was cool, because I got these from a white guy and this Magnum from a black dude. Yeah. He's the only one in here right now. What? Uh. He's right over here. No, I'm just kidding. situation with the dude, here's how it goes, okay? This is the penis, here's the condom. I'm gonna teach you my method, other methods may vary, okay? When you're in a cast smiley sex situation, here's how this goes. Ah, oh, sweet! <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, uh... <laughs> mistake. I'm a slut. We don't make mistakes. So here we go. Unless they're babies. Ayo! That's what I'm talking about. So <laughs> you put the condom on like so. Huh? But you see me? I rolled it down with expertise. So this is a white boy condom. As you can see, it only accommodates about six or seven curved inches. That's unacceptable. Uh, so I have another example. Listen up. If you could, what you do is you take the condom and you bunch it up at the entrance of your anus. And then, all at once, you push back and then you get the full force of condom on dick in butthole. It's man or wife can do it, it's really easy. So, as you can see, the Magnum Extra Large accommodates way more. And uh, if you can fit this in your asshole, you can win collective soul tickets. <laughs>